Alrighty. But there's the box. I think <laughs> if I remember this is all like Indiana college stuff. So IU and I believe Notre Dame was it? I gotta get a knife. But yeah, we're gonna bust through this real quick. Good lord, did you would use good good tape. Can't get it. Oh, Alright, open it up. Now, first start off with some hats. I believe it's mostly IU stuff, um, which is awesome. So, start out with this vintage hat. This is a collegiate li licensed nice snapback. We got this one, another snapback, same tag. And then this one, this one's a little smaller. Uh, maybe, maybe throw like more of a kid or a small head. Alright, look at these now. A couple of these wouldn't be stuff like I'd usually shop online, but it's a pretty good deal for the whole lot, so I just picked it all up. First off, we got the IU. This is a modern, or more modern at least, quarter set. New in the bookstore. I remember when I went there, these were like 150 bucks or whatever. Um, I'm gonna put it in the flea market, or maybe even on Depop for like 25, 30 bucks. Next up, we got this really cool IU vest. Good fleece vest. So I paid 150 so I got like a tickle. I paid 150 for the box. So far we got about mm, 40 bucks back, I would say. Nice vintage IU hoodie on the good Fruit of the Loom tag. This is a good size, so I may rock this one if it fits me. Um, but that right there is about $35. So got about 75 so far. Now we got a really nice.
Affliction World Tour. Kind of like, it looks like it was made this way, so it's really cool. A vintage Pepsi crew neck with the original tag still on it for 10 bucks. I think I can get at least like 30 for it. And then we got this hoodie here, which I actually couldn't buy. It had no price tag on it, but I wasn't too upset. I didn't know what it was, but it was a cool kind of Y2K style. And another Affliction tee to wrap up this haul. This is a cool one. At this stop, we picked up this John Deere camouflage hoodie. The Mountain Hardware, good fleece. I like this one a lot. And a really cool Y2K Spitfire skating long sleeve. Uh, made, in U made in Honduras, but of USA fabric, so early 2000s with a nice sleeve hit there. Next stop, we found this 80 San Diego crew neck with this Cat Von Worth crew neck, super soft and thick. The Nike Essential, and then four really nice Colts crew necks. Um, these obviously came from the same donation, which is nice to see because a lot of times when you find something like this, you usually only find one of them. So I'm super happy to find all four, good size two, all XL. Alrighty y'all, so leaving this small town now, I've been here for uh, three hours or so, <coughs> just a little over three hours, but I did grab a good amount of stuff. Um, everything in this video, I'm pretty sure is gonna be from today. So good, a good day. But um, I hit this one last stop, flat. I hit this stop for the last time. Uh, I stopped here three times just to see if they play anything else new out. But this is a ZZ Top. I think it's like a 2019 hoodie. I don't know. It was three dollars, so I just grabbed it. Like I spent ten bucks on all this stuff right here. So good deals. This one is my one of my favorite pieces of, of the day. It's a vintage Ron John, like kind of drug rug hoodie it's like a sherpa thing going on but an amazing color and a great fade so i love that one and then these i scooped on the way out um they're just a pair of vintage carpenter pants but they're a really nice fade and a good fit.
everyone. Peace.